What's up, everybody? Hey, I think it's time that we did an updated Apex demo. And if you're new to the channel, let me show you what this thing is all about. Okay, so real quick, if high level, this is my high level agency. I still maintain an agency to this day, even though we've got Apex as our own company. But this is what we're looking at. There's a tab that says launch ads. Then you go in, there's an ads library. Okay, it's all cool. Look at all these ads. I can click, enter my daily budget. Now, by the way, as you're looking at this, you should be thinking, okay, does this mean that my clients can run their own ads? If your clients can pick an ad and then put in their budget and hit launch, yes. Okay, so that is what we're talking about doing here is having the ability for your clients to go in and launch ads in just a couple of clicks. Now, if we go back to this library is all about my agency. If you work with plumbers, roofers, solar, real estate, mortgage, any type of agency serving a local business, these templates would be specific to that niche. So let's jump into the engine that is Upex. All right, welcome to Upex. So Upex is a white label SaaS product, okay? It bolts onto high level and allows you to offer click and go ads, just like you saw, to your customers. This is a sizzle offer because when customers see, hey, I can get rid of my expensive retainer agency, I can run these myself, I have control over them, they're proven to work, yada, yada, yada. When customers see that, they love it. And so acquiring customers and having that, quote, irresistible offer is so much easier when you're using Apex. Okay, so I'm gonna walk you through the platform. I'm gonna show you how it works. I'm gonna show you the different pieces. We're not gonna do a huge deep dive into every piece. We do have a free course called Lead Gen U that you can walk through and see everything. But let's go ahead and get started. We are broken, first of all, if you look at a just a high, a high level point of view here, you've got clients, this is your client tab. You've got templates, which is the primary engine in Apex. You've got metrics and then you've got settings. Very straightforward, easy to use UI. Let's go ahead and we'll start with clients. Now, when you first start up with Upex, maybe you have an existing business manager, maybe you do not. If you have an existing business manager, you will be able to add clients just by clicking a button. Okay, it's super easy. If you don't have a business manager, yes, you can actually use Upex without a business manager. I wouldn't recommend it long-term for support issues and things along those lines. However, clients do connect to Upex directly from high level. It's an easy connection. All they do is log in with their Facebook username and password, and boom, they're connected to your white label version of Upex. So if we go into the My Clients tab, once a person is signed in, this is what you're going to see. Dashboard, library, and audiences. Okay, the dashboard is basically what campaigns are currently running on that customer, and it gives you the opportunity, if you want, to launch ads from Upex. And the library is an option for you to upload custom creative for that client if you choose to. And then audiences, if you want to do custom audiences, so lookalike audiences or custom audiences based off of actions in Facebook, you can do that here without going into ads manager. So that is what's happening in the My Clients tab. Again, a deep dive of all of these things is available uh, in Lead Gen U. We go into each tab in more depth. Okay, campaign logs. So campaign logs is a great place for whoever's managing performance and things along those lines, just to check from time to see if there's been any issues. If you'll notice, it says status. If you scroll down the page, boom, there's a failed attempt, okay? Welcome message should not exceed 300 characters. So in this case, going back, fixing that, then next thing, the campaign. So this just gives you a place to go to, to make sure that these campaigns, that if users are launching their own ads, that they're not running into any issues, okay? And then account issues. Now, understand that as an agency, what are the things that have tripped us up? What are the things that are hard to manage? And that is what we are putting into Upex, which is good for you if you've been in the traditional SMA space, you'll know that sometimes Facebook doesn't spend the budget or sometimes we get disapproved ads. And without going into an individual ad account, how would we ever know that? 
account issues is where you're going to find all of these issues. So you can drop down. Okay, here we've got an issue on this singular campaign here. And then if we go over, it says your ads are not spending their full budget. Okay, we go in, we optimize the campaign and boom. Now, instead of our media buyers, if we have one media buyer that it takes him a full week to go through and do optimizations, now we have all the issues in one page and they can do it, bam, in just minutes. Next, we go into the templates section. Now, I said the templates section is the driver of of the Upex engine. If you're going to sell one template to many, which is the idea of a marketing control and advertising, if you're an advertiser and you've been doing this for a long time, the history of advertising is all about establishing a proven creative and offer and then using it over and over until it's run its course and then coming up with something new. That's what we've done with this. Instead of going through copy and pasting, your proven ads from one ad account to another, so on and so forth. You can now do that one time. And then with the click of a button, it's in every subsequent client account that attaches to Upex. So the template library is a free resource that we provide for our Upex customers. Okay, you can think of it like Facebook's ad library. Okay, you come in here and you're like, dental, I wanna, I have a dental niche. What offers do you have available? Boom, here we have offers for you to click import. You can import all of these templates into your account. You can preview them. You can say, oh, this is what that looks like. You can actually go to the details of this. So you can see, oh, here's what the ad copy looks like. Here's what all of the things in the entire template look like. These are the ad creatives. Here you go. Okay, they're all available for you. All fully customizable. You can download them, change the images, change the ad copy, do whatever you want. It's very simple. Okay, so that template library, we have over, I think, four or 500 individual templates in a lot of different niches. Okay, so the template library is there for you. Now, template tools. Let's say you get a template. You're like, hey, I really like this particular dental offer that I just saw, but I wanna make it my own. I wanna adapt it to me. We have these really cool AI generated ad copy tools. So you can create a template from scratch. So you enter in some inputs here, okay? You follow the instructions and it will actually write an ad for you and assist you in the ad writing process specifically for Facebook ads. It'll also take proven group on offers in lead gen U, we actually have a module in there where you can watch this video you can see how we find specific proven offers in groupon and repurpose those into facebook ads we have the facebook ad rewriter which effectively again go to the ad library go to facebook ads library go to twitter ad library and find these proven assets or these assets that fit a criteria where you're like, hey, there's some legs behind this campaign. Put it in here, rewrite it, now it's your own. Okay, we've got the Google Ad one. We have the landing page converter. We have purchase a professional made template. If you want us to do that for you, you can purchase that as well right from template tools. Now, my templates. My templates is where things get really fun. Now, my templates is what your high-level SaaS accounts will see. Up until now, your high-level SaaS accounts can't see any of this information. This is for your eyes only as the agency. But in the My Templates tab, this is what mirrors over into high-level. So you'll see we have event marketing, new account seeding, private templates, and then event marketing, new account seeding, private templates. So what we put in here reflects over there. This is what you build out. This is what the product ends up being to your end customers. So this is all right here. And the My Categories section just helps you organize these into categories. All right, let's jump into the metrics category. Now, the metrics category, we have had people say, I would buy Upex only for the reporting, for the metrics section. Why? If you look at this, you can pick date ranges. And then based on those date ranges, you can find a lot of really important data, cost of leads, conversion, right? All of these metrics, you can rank them by metric. 
Okay, simply by click, clicking the KPI, you can rate them by lowest to highest, or in this case, from highest to lowest. Okay, you can dive down specifically to the templates that particular location is running. Okay, and you can see all of the performance of that account. Okay, you can see everything. Pretty cool. Let's go to template metrics. Now, template metrics is where Apex really made a splash in the media buying community, mostly because before Apex, there was no way for you to aggregate performance data on a single campaign. Meaning, if I was an agency before Apex, a traditional SMMA agency, and I go to customers and I say, hey, I have this ad copy and this offer and this creative, I put it on yours and then yours, I'd have to use a spreadsheet to collect and aggregate that data to see what the performance was on that. But in this case, I can just look at a template and I can see how much ad spend has been spent on and then I can see all of the metrics across the board. And I can also dive down and I can see all of the individual locations and their performance. And now I'm getting macro data, which really means something much different than what you've been able to do. And you can't do that in ads manager. In ads manager, you can't have a hundred different ads manager accounts and put them into one and see the performance. You can't do that. But with Upex, you can. And then we jump into ad metrics and ad metrics allows you to deep dive into every individual template, find out which images are producing the best results and which ones are not producing as good results, which you weed out the bad and you put in more of the good and you model that process. All right, then managing accounts, very simple tab from time to time, if you need to disconnect somebody and reconnect them to refresh the connection, sometimes there's glitches between ads manager and any software for that matter, but Upex is no exclusion. So you just disconnect and reconnect the preferences tab. So you take this link here. Okay. You grab that and then you go over to high level, go to the agency settings, push that in, put that into the custom menu link and boom, you're able to add the launch ads or Facebook ads, whatever you want to call it right here to be able to offer Facebook SaaS to your customers. And for a tab by tab walkthrough and a deep dive of every section, just go to the description below. There's a link for it. And thanks for watching. We'll see you on the next video.